coach Jose Tavares telling me that the importance of that is that it dictates what he likes to see for that front line. And that's what Laurent Courtois starting 11 this 3-4-3 have to deal with. And we start the Eastern Conference semifinal, the second. Who's going to meet New England in the conference final? Cut back. Cambridge tries to chest it down. It's too heavy of a touch, but Columbus gives the ball away. Cambridge just hits the post. And the ball out for a goal kick. Another player from the outside of Cambridge, plays centrally, wins that second ball, and you give him him second bite at the apple, he's going to make you pay. Hits it extremely clean. Big bodies in the box. Ajiman stands at 6'4", but the ball's cut back. This will be in a shot. Just wide. Really clever here from Crown Legacy. Little cutback ball to Pareba. Clean first touch out of his body and just laces this thing. Unfortunate wide of that goal of Lapkus. Ja Pedro steps in for a banger. It's stopped by Lapkus. He's digging after this shot from Ja Pedro. What a terrific strike to center back. No one closes down the spot. Don't mind if I do. The time and space for Crown Legacy to find those gaps that they found all regular season. Williams finds a gap behind the defense, cuts it back. The shot from Tavares. Oh my, what a stop from Lopkis. Ball still free. Pekovic. Chow Page is just so good at picking and choosing when to play direct, but also understands their space in beyond. This back line of Columbus crew too. Give credit to Williams as this back line of Columbus crew is retreating. Where's the real save? It's a cutback ball. Big time save. From Sends it back into the box. And after the miss, the first half comes to a close. So Charles Rogers comes on for Mateo Bunbury and Diego Almeida comes on for Gio De Libera as we start the second half in the semifinals. Nicoletto swerves through, stopped initially. Fusan has an opportunity, and Columbus scores the opener. Noah Fusan behind the defense, bangs in the shot, and the crew lead 1-0 on top of Crown Legacy. We talked about the threat that Fusan possesses to be vertical. He just plays off the shoulder of the two center backs of Crown Legacy. And what a fantastic finish. The composure, the technical ability. All into Tavares. And again, smothered defensively. Somehow finds an outlet. Williams whips it into the box. Headed on by Ajivan. But Stanislav Lopkis, a stalwart in goal. Great entry ball, essentially. Tavares does very well, as it requires so much attention. There's someone free on the bar, far end. Williams, terrific ball in. Ajima does everything right. Heads it back across where it came from. But what a fantastic save that is. Roberts. Muhammad. Elevated ball. Headed back towards the middle. Still free. And the ball. Just on the outside. And that would have been a disastrous turn of events for Crown Legacy. When you're talking defending, to head it back across into a center location. You head her up and away. Crown Legacy get away with one. Ajimon around the defense. Patrick Ajimon is stonewalled by Stanislav Lobkis. Had the space to play in beyond this back line with Ajimon. Just gets a better body position of his individual marker. As Mayaka. And Rodriguez to Costa play pass. Mayaka steps forward. Philip Mayaka, oh! Not one to take shots very often, but called his own number. And Stanislav Lapkis. And much like Pedro, like we saw in the first half, no one, no one closes down the space. Don't mind if I do. Hits it extremely clean. It's with. Columbus, they clear it away, and they shock the regular season champions. 